Hi guys, it's me Tammy and Kaylee and we're here with a very quick Mommy Monday tip on how to detangle your kid's hair. Kaylee has a lot of hair, turn around. I mean, she's got a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And she's been swimming a lot and it's just been, whew. So what I do to detangle her hair and I do this like fairly quickly is I always use some kind of like spray bottle like this and I got this from Sally's it was like eight bucks and then I use some kind of leave-in like conditioning detangler and a wet brush if her hair is super super bad a wet brush is not gonna work I'm gonna have to use a comb but for the purpose of this video we're just gonna use a wet brush if her hair needs some extra moisture either I use an oil or I use the cream let me show you those the cream I use is this combing cream and it's by Maui Moisture Hair Care and it is for dry damaged curly hair and it softens, detangles and defines or I use this pure shea oil and this is from Sally Beauty so I actually do think that we're gonna need a little extra so I'm gonna put a pump of this but I'm gonna put it on the underside of her hair which is what is the worst part so I'm just lifting it up adding some water like a decent amount using one pump Kaylee's telling her own story over here right using one pump and I'm just rubbing it through her head oh you're singing oh. it's my song from my from your dance yes okay. from my turn this way so they can see yes so I start from the bottom I had already started doing this which is why it seems so easy <laughs> To get through but I promise it's normally not this easy she used she used like a toothbrush that never beans on the tooth and then she that's for the front of your hair yeah she's talking about what I use for the baby hairs so you can see there's plenty of tangles back here mm -hmm. so I normally just do the, all of the hair at once so I try to get like all the big knots out first and then I section everything come closer to my then I section everything so that I can get the smaller knots that are kind of hidden. Now keep in mind, I do think that the water and the wet brush and the conditioner are like the absolute must-haves. I feel for me, I cannot untangle Kaylee's hair dry. It just does not work, especially with this wet brush. You mean not a kid, I'm a first grader now. Yes, my little first grader now. So, I did that part. Now we're gonna section it because the part that really has a lot of knots is the part on the bottom. So I'm just gonna section that a little bit. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm just gonna take a hair tie. I normally take a clip. I'm gonna do the same thing all, oh my gosh. Same thing all over again, turn around. <laughs> no, I didn't say oh my gosh because it was bad. I actually said oh my gosh because it was so much better than I expected. Mm -hmm. This is normally so bad uh, because she she um, just came back from her grandparents' house yesterday and they have a pool. So she's always in the pool. And chlorine really wreaks havoc on your hair. So... I like how I like you wish you were a boy? Because your hair can get tangled. Boys can have long hair and it can get tangled too. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Nah. Only if I have short hair. You want short hair? Yeah. No. No, right? She, I look she like always a... says that and then she's like, I'm going to look like a boy. And then when I was five or six, mm -hmm. or not six and a half, um, there was like... Are you going to go to your haircut or we have to cut your hair bowl? Yes, I did tell you that. So, another tip that you can use so that there isn't too much pulling. If there's a knot near the bottom, hold the hair really tight, squeeze it, and then you can kind of pull a little harder without it tugging at the scalp. Um, this is so funny because I thought that this was going to be a super tangly hair day. And I think I finally found a good combo of products <laughs> that have made the tangling just so much easier. So show them the back of your hair now. So that is the back now. Basically not free. Basically and I don't like this 
the bun on the top. I know you don't like the bun on the top. And then we're gonna do this part. And the side of her head always gets a lot of um, knots too. I think it's just the side she sleeps on. You can hear that, right? You can hear that noise. I watch French Bob with my mom. The yes. There's more than one. There is more than one. All right, so the side of her hair, this side right here, always gets a lot of tangles. So I put a lot of water. And then I then you brush my hair like Rapunzel when she was little. Yes, I brush your hair like Rapunzel. And I try not to use too much of the combing cream because that is kind of thick and it can weigh hair down. Thankfully, her hair is so thick. I feel like it doesn't really matter how much product I use, like nothing weighs her hair down. It like never looks greasy or oily. So I just kind of comb it through slowly. I will section it off if need be. And mommy has a new camera. I do have a new camera. So, and I will turn it over to get to the underside. You just kind of do a little flip. Sorry, princess. Sorry, princess. Okay. And normally I do use a comb no. to really get through this, but I have to wash her hair anyway tonight. So I'm not gonna like put myself through that struggle of all that detangling to just have to redo it again. And somebody picked her words with a pencil when she was a baby. You better watch that. It's super funny and super and super sad. Yes, you're right. It is super funny and super sad. So, I watched it before with Mia and me and Nana when I was a baby and when Mia was little. Okay, so that is how I detangle Kaylee's hair quickly. So the three things that you really need are a continuous spray brush. This works better. The mist is finer, so <laughs> so the hair is not completely soaked, just damp. Can you give me hey, what you just dropped? Me. Can you give me what you just dropped, please? And a yes and the wet brush, and then some kind of detangling spray. I really do like this one by Honest. I've um, been using it for like two or three weeks now and it's really been helping. And then if the hair is really bad, this Maui Shea Butter Combing Cream. Now, Kaylee has, I say probably, turn around buddy. She's probably got, this is combed out. Her natural hair, <laughs> the top, this back portion right here, is probably 2B, 2C hair. And then the very front is like one. It's so crazy. Where my hair is the opposite, I actually have like 2B hair in the front and then the back is one. So yeah, her hair is quite thick. She's got enough She's got enough hair for two people, I swear. Every time I take her to the hair salon, they're like, oh my goodness, so much hair, right? Lucy has so much hair. All right, guys. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something new. Bye, guys.